Hi there, welcome back to the channel. Now, we've had our pizzas. The oven's slowly cooling down. It's just above 300 degrees at the moment. And I'm going to make a sort of one pan Oreo cookie. Now, of course, I will leave the ingredients in the description. But basically, it's just your normal cookie ingredients. It's got butter, sugar, one egg, flour, a little bit of vanilla extract, chocolate chips, and it's also got, in this one, some Oreo pieces. So it's like an Oreo cookie bar. Just to make it a bit more Oreo, Oreo noodle. Just to make it a bit more Oreo cookie. We're going to put an Oreo cookie in the middle. Like that. And then we'll try not to mess it up. We'll try and keep it in the middle like that. Okay, so there we go. I'm just going to scrape away because I've put a little bit in. It's going to rise up a little bit. So just going to take away a wee bit of dough. And there we go. So I'll turn it round. I've cracked the cookie. But oh well, it doesn't matter, does it? So there we go. There's our oil cookie. So easy. We're going to put that in the oven and we're just going to let it cook for a little while. Now what we want is we don't want it to be like a, like a proper crispy cookie. We want it a bit gooey so we can serve it with some ice cream. So it's going to be really nice. So it's probably going to take about three, four, five minutes to cook, but we'll see. We'll put it in and we'll see how long it takes. The oven's at 299 degrees now and that'll fall, that'll fall in temperature quite quickly quite, because that's what it tends to do. Like I say, it's been pizza night, so we're just going to leave this here for two seconds just to heat the bottom up because we don't like to put the cold cast iron pan into the oven straight away. So we're just letting it catch up to temperature a little bit and then we're going to put it in and then we're going to cook it. Okay, and it goes. We're just going to put the door over. And then we'll come back in about five minutes. Okay, so like I say, while well, that's cooking, here's some cookies I made earlier with the same dough. So these are like little uh, Oreo cookies. They've got little Oreo bits in, they've got chocolate chips in, made from exactly the same dough, but obviously these are crispy. These take about 10 minutes at 180 degrees. I cook them in the normal oven, but obviously you could probably cook them in the dome as well, but it's just a bit easier to do them in the normal oven so that they would be ready in time for this video. But yeah, they smell, they really smell like Oreos. I'm not going to taste one now. They're just for decoration. We're saving the main event for what's in there. So let's wait on that to cook. We'll come back in a sec. Okay, so it's been about five or six minutes. I think that's going to be long enough, personally. So let's have a look at what's happened. Oh, look at that. Doesn't that look absolutely delicious? Right, I need to get it so it says Oreo. Right, this is hot, so I'm going to need to come over here. Okay, there's our little cookies we've put in the middle for some decoration. And look at that. Doesn't that look nice? Can't wait to try it. Looks lovely. So, of course, you've got to put some ice cream on this. The ice cream's got a bit melty because it's so warm out here. But, eh, uh, there we go. Bit of ice cream. And what we've got here is some homemade chocolate sauce. This is made with double cream melted chocolate. A blend of milk chocolate and dark chocolate. Simple as that. And that's it done. How good does that look? So let's give it a try. Got to give it a try. I'm going to get a bit of that Oreo in the middle. And eating. So, if I got the audio, I have. Oh my god, that's so good. I'm going to have another bit. Just one more bit, because it's so good. But ice cream. Mm. Oh my god, that's delicious. That's really delicious. Ouch. Still hot too. So, eh. <laughs> Did it burn myself? Hey, not a chef, you don't burn yourself. The audio is actually still really crunchy, which is quite nice. It adds a nice little bit of crunch in it, but it's it's actually really crunchy. And as you can see, it's cooked absolutely quite nice in the middle. It's not mega gooey, but it's just gooey enough that it's warm. It's absolutely delicious. That is gorgeous. So, like I say, it's my standard cookie recipe. I'll put it in the description just because I sort of make it and I never remember what the measurements are. But I'll tell you the measurements in the description. It's real easy. Two types of sugar, butter, flour, vanilla extract, and also an egg as well, with only chocolate chips and cookie. But I'll put the exact measurements in the description. But give that a try because it's gorgeous. And it's so easy to make an oven once you've done pizza. You just get one of these, put your cookie dough in, leave it five minutes and it's ready. Put a bit of ice cream top. Who won't feel to be impressed with how good that looks? 
brilliant. So yeah, like, subscribe, leave comment. We'll see you next time on Chicken Book. Check out the <laughs> <laughs> Bye.